for draw and instant games. The General Store on 24 in Lewis. Radio check one, two, one, two. Jessica's juice is on. Power 1017. All right, 840. Jess, what you got? Britney Spears was pulled over by the police for speeding last month. And this is according to The Blast. She's pregnant. Did you know that? That happened when you were away. We made an announcement that Britney Spears I did hear that. Yes, I did hear that. I don't know if it's true and all that and rumors or whatever. No, she said it, didn't she? No, she she said it. Look, look. There was another story coming out saying that it wasn't true and all that good stuff. But anyway, um, she was given a ticket for unsafe speed for prevailing conditions when she was stopped by the California Highway Patrol on March the 10th. And she's now scheduled to appear in court. On May the 3rd. Hold on. Give me the inside scoot. Yeah, up on her 14 hours ago. Up on Britney Spears on IG. um, She has what looks like, I mean, it's a baby, but it's. um, Oh, okay. I didn't know she posted that. That's not. Her that's not her baby. That's not her right. baby, but it's like a, it's like a what's picture. What's the caption? It says, really? This is what's going on inside of me? And then the pregnant woman emoji or whatever. Okay. So. I'm happy for her if she is. That's on her uh, IG. And then trying to look at where she made that announcement. Go ahead, Britt. And we talked about it. Um, but, you know, Britney Spears, she has a lot of haters. And um, there was people, you know, claiming that it was just her, you know, doing this for attention and things like that. But I don't think she's joking about something like this. Okay. Jack Harlow is celebrating his new single first class, debuting at number one on the Billboard Hot 100 chart. This marks his first solo number one single and second career number one, which was Industry Baby and has multi-platinum uh, smashed collaboration with Lil Nas X. First Class followed Harlow's previously released Nail Tech and is the second offering from the Hitmaker sophomore album, Come Home, The Kids Miss You, which drops on May the 6th. So good luck there. Post Malone is making the headlines as well. A federal judge ruled yesterday that Post Malone must stand trial in a copyright lawsuit that claims that he failed to credit producer and songwriter Tyler Arms for the 2019 hit Circles. Billboard reports that he's a Canadian producer and songwriter and says that he co-wrote the chords and the bass line that would ultimately become part of Circles. The U.S. District uh, Judge Wright wrote in his decision that it was clear that he was not involved in the final cut of the song, but that early version formed the basis of the final cut and a verdict um, you know, if if he actually has the session track and that he's entitled to this, he would actually receive substantial royalties from it. So a federal judge is ruling that Post Malone must stand trial in this copyright lawsuit. And it looks like the guy might actually win. Wow. Yeah. Also, the jury selection process began yesterday for Black China's $100 million lawsuit against the Kardashian-Jenner family. Yeah, and they were there, and four something members. about the, the sex tape came yes, up. Yes, yeah, four members I heard of about the family this. were present at the Los Angeles courthouse, including Kim Kardashian, Khloe Kardashian, Kris Jenner, and Kylie Jenner. China was present in the courthouse as well, along with her attorney. China's ex, Rob, was not present during yesterday's meeting. China, we know her name is Angela White. She filed her lawsuit against the Kardashian-Jenner family back in 2017. The suit states that Rob Kardashian is an abuser intent on destroying Angela White, the mother of his baby, who left him in 2016. In revenge, the Kardashian-Jenner family became media predators, shaming her on social media, and killing her hit show, Rob and China, which had already began filming its second season. The Kardashian Jenners filed a lawsuit on their own in retaliation that same year, claiming that China violently attacked Rob. So Kim, Chloe, Chris, and Kylie are all expected to testify during the trial. Wow. All right. And then the Lakers reportedly are uninterested in the Russell Westbrook trade. Apparently, the Lakers are trying to figure out Um, you know, if they're going to get them or not. But they had a horrific season. They did not make the playoffs. The team now has some very big decisions to make. Of course, one of those decisions pertains to Russell Westbrook, who did not perform like the team was hoping. Everyone thought that Russ could make this team, you know, a big contender. But in the end, he just wasn't the guy that the Lakers needed him to be. So they have a lot to figure out 
pertaining to Russell Westbrook and the trade. Yeah, they need to get rid of him. Wow. Mm, good stuff. So, uh, 845. It's a Bill and Jessica show. <laughs> <laughs>